Let us now go over the new website editor. With the new website editor, you may now select your design, select your banner, upload your own customized image, or simply upload your own pictures from your computer. To get started, you need to be logged onto your Realtor Toolkit. Click on the website editor link on the left hand side of the screen. And now you want to pick Website Designer, select your colors, choose your layout. You can choose where to put your buttons or your link on the home page of your website. You could either put them on the left hand side or on the top of the screen. Now if you have a lot of links, I suggest that you use the top navigation. If you click on Featured Listings, you will have your listings flashing through a slideshow on your home page. If you pick a standard design, like this one, you will just see a still photo on the home page of your website. The last option you have is the animated design. If you click this one, you will be given a bunch of beautiful pictures to post on your home page through a slideshow. This can be chosen if you don't have any listing or simply if you just want pictures instead of your listings flashing on your home page. I could preview the design, or I can just hit Next to go to the next tab. Once I hit Next, it's going to give me a lot of options. I could select my own banner, or I could upload my own photo as my banner, and I could select my animation since I selected this the animation design option. Now, the banner is up here. If you want to show it, you need to keep this checked. If you want to show the text on your home page, click on Show Footer. If you don't want to show it, you can uncheck it. If you want to change the text on your home page, click on Change. You will be given a window, a Word document type of window, where you could change the text on your home page. You could put images, change the background color, format your text, do almost anything that you want and change it on your home page. Click Save. Once that's done, you could go ahead and save preview or just save it to finish. You are now taken back to the website editor.